Hi guys, so I have something to share with you I don't think I've shared for a while and that is a fashion haul. Oh yes. I went clothes shopping and shoe shopping actually. Um, basically um, if you've been watching my vlogs you'll know that I've been kind of trimming down the junk that I eat and trying to like sort of exercise more and I have been exercising. I haven't spoken about it in my vlogs because it's literally like a pitiful 20 minutes of exercise every couple of days. Um, I didn't think it was worth noting until I got it up to some kind of standard but since um, December, no not December, September last year I got on the scale and I was about 11 stone and I know that probably doesn't sound like a lot but I'm only 5 foot 4 and that is according to doctors charts according to medical charts that is um borderlining the overweight category for my height and age so i decided to um sort of nip that in the bud basically and um just start cutting out junk food eating less fried food at work less fizzy less sugary fizzy drinks and um less cakes ice cream just cutting out crap basically and it worked. I currently am 8'10 approximately so I think that's a, that was a pretty good achievement in the length of time. I do want to lose another about half stone to a stone to get back to where I, I was when I was slimmer. Um, Because I used to be really skinny. Um, but as it stands I figured I would buy new clothes. I mean I've gone through my wardrobe and gotten rid of all the clothes I wasn't able to fit into and now that I can they're no longer in fashion. So um, I decided to buy new clothes and I'm gonna show you them. Hey, <laughs> I'm gonna get Timmy because he's screaming and it's bugging me. Timmy! Come here! Timothy! <gasps> Do, does the Timmy want to say hi? He's so happy. He's always happy. It, he's like stupidly happy. First of all, I'm going to start with the shoes. Um, they're both from New Look. One is just a simple pair of Bally flats, but they're cobalt blue. And they're awesome. Um, I think these were only like £7, £7.99 or something. But yeah, they're just cold, cobalt blue flats. I have actually haven't had a pair of flats like this in like six months. Um, I've been mostly just wearing heels and um, it feels a little odd to be back in flats but I, I've never had blue shoes. Like ever. So I was super excited. <laughs> I know I'm easily entertained. And the other pair of shoes I got were these ones also from New York. And these were £25. They're sort of a, a faux leather sort of lizard effect. At least I... They don't smell like leather. So I assume they're faux leather. And they are beautiful. Um, they are really stiff. So if you are going to purchase them... Sorry, I just hit you with the shoe. If you are going to purchase them, I would recommend trying them in on in the store because you might have to take a size up. I should have taken a size up, I think, but I will grin and bear it because they're just so beautiful. They need a bit of um, a stretching right here for me because I have a a wide bit on my foot. Like I, I'm not, I'm not, I haven't got a wide foot per se, but the ball of my foot, there's like this knobbly bit from wearing too many heels. <laughs> God, that's so gross sounding but there's like this knobbly bit from where it heals too much and um yeah it makes it wider to put my feet in things yeah that makes sense so <laughs> onto the clothes i got things from both new look and primark i got a lot a lot of blouses blouses are like the key style update at the moment it's all about looking classy um, so first of all, this one's from Primark. It's a sort of mottled blue and pink flower arrangement on a black background. It's it's sheer. It's sleeveless. I'm sure I just said that 
whatever. Um, it's sheer, but it's not see-through, so it's it's nice and lightweight. It has little gold button details. It's really, really pretty. It's really comfy to wear. It's a nice cut. And I think... I can't remember how much it was, actually. Um, someone, give me a tag. It was about eight pounds, which is all right for Primark, to be honest. Um, the other sort of florally print one I got from Primark was this dusty baby pink shade with sort of grey flower pattern. Again, the same sort of gold button detail. It's beautiful. It's so, so pretty. I can't wait to wear it. It's going to look really nice with this chains. Um, this came from Topshop, by the way. It's just sort of like a snake chain sort of thing. I got it around Christmas time. But I around still have it. This sort of necklace is really caught right now for such a corny term but it is. The style is is very in right now. It's very sort of 80s sort of Sloan Ranger-ishness and um, most clothing stores have something similar so yep. But yeah, baby pink with grey flowers really really pretty. I got some block colour ones from Primark as well. I got this really nice khaki green one which I have worn so it's inside out. Oops. It's a lot denser a material. It's still a bit sheer but it's not see-through and it has a really nice pocket detail and it also has the covered buttons. It's very similar in um, a similar feel to the striped shirt I got in my last fashion haul from Primark, just a sort of a, a shorter sleeved version. It's not exactly sleeveless because the sleeves do come out a little bit, but it's not a cap sleeve if that makes sense. But it's really nice, it's really pretty and I picked it up in Kelly Green as well. Oh, it's so, so nice. I'm not showing them very well. I suck at showing clothes. Um, but I'm going to do a few outfit of the days with these clothes. Most definitely, because they just they make me feel very chic and feminine and very pretty. So I'm going to do outfits of the day now. Decided. Um, I really like this colour. It comes in a nice cobalt blue as well and a couple of other different colours. Um, but Kelly Green is very sort of a very good style update colour at the moment, so I would recommend the green. I also picked up a couple of vest tops. They're quite silky ones. This is sort of a, a blue a blue silver shade and it has this really nice sort of net detail at the bottom. It's just really nice and simple, kind of dressy, kind of swish. And I picked up this one in it's sort of an aqua green with a nice white floral detail. Very nice. And these were both only £4, which was a bargain. Um, also, while in Primark, I picked up three pairs of trousers. These trousers, I've had them before, but I bought them in a size too small, so I didn't really get the chance to wear them properly. Um, so I actually bought them in a size that fits now, so I thoroughly enjoy them. They're only £9 a pair, which is awesome. And they are these gorgeous, slick slacks. Um, it's a very nice sort of satiny, cotton material. Um, they do attract lint quite easily, that is let down, but £9 a pair, people. £9 a pair. Um, they sort of sit about an inch above the ankle. Um, they're really nice fitted, um, they're not baggy, they don't have that defined line down the middle so you don't have to worry too much about ironing them. Um, and I might pick up a few more pairs for work. So I picked up a pair in navy, um, I picked up this kind of tan colour which is a pair I was wearing earlier today which is why they're all crinkled and creased. And I also picked up a black pair which I've worn to work. And um, decided they are work worthy, to be honest. Oh, they also have pockets. I forgot to mention that. They have little hip pockets. Not that I would recommend putting anything in them, but they're there.
So I got three pairs of slacks from Primark and I think that was everything that I got from Primark. Yes. So now on to new look. Um, I got a couple of striped blouses which again are quite hot right now. Um, all the magazines are touting stripes, monochrome, denim, um, nautical stripes. Oh, stripes. Stripes are good this season. Um, so I got this kind of denim blue cotton. It's a denim blue with um, white stripes. It's a nice light cotton. Has couple has two breast pockets. Buttons all the way down. It's just very light and airy. It's something that you could wear over something else, um, just as a throw on or wear it by itself. Really nice and chic. And I picked up this gorgeous sort of, um, it's sort of the same sort of silky material as the ones from Primark. A bit heavier of a material, but it's a really nice sort of broad stripe pattern with, um, well, they'd like you to roll the sleeves up apparently, but uh, I don't. <laughs> but they're really, really pretty and Oh gosh, I didn't realise this was so expensive. This one was £20 and this one was £18. Definitely worth the investment though, I think. They're pieces I'm going to be wearing all freaking year long. Um, another blouse that I got was, it's very, in fact it's almost identical actually. No, it's a totally different flower. Never mind. It's sort of, sort of a stone blue with grey flowers. Again, it's sleeveless. Um, it has a really nice sort of matching blue button detail. This was again £18. It's very lightweight, very sheer. Um, and it's very, 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 very long. It's the kind of thing I think you could throw on um, with a vest and leggings or skinny jeans and it would look really really chic or over shorts maybe we shall see we shall see another striped item that I got was this um, I'm not actually sure what cut this would be but it's a really nice sort of crepe material crepe is very in at the moment as well and it has a little bit of a zipper detail on the back on the back, not as prominent as we have been seeing, but um, it's definitely a more modern twist and it's a really nice sort of, it has a lower back to it. It's very lightweight. It does sit a bit tight on the shoulders, so I would recommend trying this piece on before purchasing, but it's workable definitely. This stripe is more of a nautical stripe. Um, it's very, um, it kind of reminds me of a Victorian bathing suit, if that makes sense. Um, it's very lightweight, it's very, it's very soft. It's gonna be perfect with the, with the slacks that I got. And it has this weird slit detail at the side. It comes quite high up. Like the slit comes sort of like up to your middle, up to up your midriff. So I'm not entirely sure why that is, if that's gonna be a thing. Um I will have to look into it and find out and find a way to style it. But I think that might just be to make it easier to do the the, the flowy tuck in look. So Oh my god. <laughs> There's this piece of hair just here and it keeps coming back. Oh, whatever, whatever. And as you guys know, the kimono style jacket was really in last year. They, the trend is continuing but it's taking on a, a less um, eccentric twist. So there's less tassels, it's less beady, it's more 
simple fabrics like this one. This is a nice sort of three quarter sleeve kimono jacket. It's sort of the um, marsala sort of colour with a nice floral detail. It's very um, Empire England. It's very 1920s. It's very, it's very nice. It's very very nice and I like how they style it on the mannequin in the new look because they, they have the sort of fur stole with it. Oh, pretty. And lastly from new look, I picked up something that I have never owned and that is a pair of patterned trousers. Oh yes. Um, they're a pretty similar cut to the Primark slacks um, except it's a, a more, it's a thicker material, it's more matte doesn't have pockets either. These were um, $19.99. That's how much these were. And they have a really nice um, sort of cut detail at the bottom and it has a really thick hem so if you wanted to you could turn up the ends in some sort of way. Um, I would recommend being careful putting these on because I did actually rip the hem on the inside with my toe putting these on. It does get quite tapered towards the end. But they are really comfy, really kind of their statement unto themselves so you could wear everything else really plain and just wear these and that would be your statement part of your outfit. So when I go clothes shopping I fairly go all out and there's still a couple of pieces that I want to get. I know, I know, I know. Um, I do want to get a few, um, I want to get new basics and I want to get um, a few nice tops, you know, similar to um, similar to this, this sort of style of nice top that isn't a blouse and possibly a few of those um, those really nice full volume skirts. They look so so pretty and oh my god they have some really nice heels in New Look at the moment. They have some really nice kitten court shoes with the pointy toe and they have these really nice ones with the simple straps on them. I want them. I want them. But that is everything for the moment. Um, keep an eye out for Outfits of the Day coming soon. I used to do those a long time ago and I really miss doing them. But I got to this point where I was like, you know, I don't go anywhere. Why am I getting dressed up just to go to Tesco? And now I figure, why not get dressed up to go to Tesco, you know? Live in the moment. Live the life. So I will catch you guys later. Thanks so much for watching and bye bye.